Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Trisha Career Minds Creations and today I have a project share um, swap to share with you guys that I made for my partner Lanny Jones and my group Craft and Manipulators. It was a loaded mini album and it had to be a Halloween theme so we had to make a um, a mini album out with the pages uh, um, were a well i used a tutorial um i forgot who the tutorial was from but anyway i posted a link to the tutorial to, to the tutorial for everybody that's participating so i said they had to um pretty much make the pockets uh according to the tutorial so we can um load it up with goodies and but you could do the cover you want to but again it had to be halloween themed and we also had to make a halloween themed uh wand so uh i'm going to show you first my uh mini op that i made and this is the way it, what it looks like um i added um a chipboard card uh, cover to my um mini album because uh, i wanted to be more sturdy um the pages you know probably would have been okay without the uh cover but I wanted to add a cover so this is the way it uh, opens uh, I use I forgot what paper packages but it was an old paper stud that I got from um, Michaels and I put a, a metal piece and a silver gem on there and I popped it up with like two three uh, thicknesses of uh, pop dots or um, foam dots to uh, make it off the paste I can uh, tie it Close the way I just untied it and I cut the paper so that this spot will be on the front and I just added this little embellishment on the front of it it's happy Halloween again this is the bag and I put another gem here to hold in the bag now first um, it had to be at least four pages so this is the first page and I don't really um, do a lot to it I might add still add some more to it but this is like a, a piece of the paper that was uh, left from the stack um, I did a little pocket here well it's not actually a pocket because I put um, double sided tape there so it sticks under there and it won't come out so I put that up there and um, I really didn't decorate the pockets of the pages a lot I might go back and do that later um, I th but anyway uh, basically we had to uh, add some goodies to the um, pocket to the pages and these, this is a set of uh, quick paper rosettes that I made. I made three of each, three purple, three black, and three orange. I'm to put the papers back in there. And yeah, I gave her um, some adhesive rhinestones, little bats and skulls. And that's that first pocket. And there's a pocket right here. Like I said, I got, I'm going to add some more things to it, I guess. I thought I did. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, and I added some pumpkins. It's glow on one side and not on the other. And it's like six of them in here. It's two of each. Uh, then I'm going to take them out, though. And then I cut some... Uh, I got some samples of um, the skulls. And then the other one, I got pumpkins. I was putting the package so I can see the pumpkins and now I'm going to take it out. I just don't want to take this out, guys. I've probably seen these before. And I said, the thing is, we could, we, they could be either store-bought or handmade goodies. It just basically had to be a stuffed mini. So that's that. And I gave her some uh, felt booze. A few of those in the pack. Wait a minute. Okay, yeah. Then the next page, I have some stickers. So I put those in there. Uh, I got these at Walmart. I don't, I, I, you know what? I got them and then, like, I really don't like them. So I had just said, like, I'm not going to use these. So I went ahead and gave them, put them in there, and fold them in half. And then I gave some samples of ribbon. Uh, Halloween. This is purple uh, black glitter and you see the spider of the uh, 
the mask design on it and then there's another one with skulls and they're both um got wire in them so i gave up some samples of ribbon i just wrapped it around some orange cardstock and then the last page um there's some uh halloween gems that's black silver orange and purple in there and here are some wood pieces it's a lot of pieces in there. I think it's probably like 12 pieces. Like uh, it's a ghost, a boo, a spider web, a witch's hat, a cat, a witch, a pumpkin. And yeah, some things in there. So that's that with veneers. And then here are some uh, foam stickers. There's a, uh, uh, I forgot what that's called. I can't remember what this is called, but um, it's a bat, uh, pumpkin, and spiders, and eyeballs, a ghost. Thank you. So I just gave me some of those. Um, but yeah, then there's another pocket right there. I thought I added more to this. I guess I gotta go back and finish this. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna add some more, you know, tags and pockets and things to it, or embellishments to the pages. Um, but basically, it was basically just supposed to be a um loaded um. Uh, mini album so I'll probably just leave it and let her decorate it the way she wants it wants to she can probably decorate it with some of the goodies that I put in here or no uh, but yeah this is the mini album that I created and I had fun making this because it's been a minute since I made mini albums and I love used to love making them um, so yeah got back into doing that and then we had to make a Halloween wand. And so uh, I uh, decided to do a wand in a, um, like a pinwheel uh, fashion. Um, this is what I used my uh, new pinwheel by Memory, Memory Keepers punch board. Punch board and um, they, I like it. It's pretty fun. I used one of my um, black and white uh, paper straws, thick paper straws. And I used some Halloween paper. Um, I think these this page was like other it was four by four square, and we had to use two colors. And uh, yeah, so this is the uh, what I come up with, and I had some ribbon hanging from that. And it's a cut apart from a paper stack that I had. It's called Totally Witches, <laughs> and it's a um black crepe paper and some uh, lace under there and I put a little I glued a little ghost there and I used some it's not stickles but I used some other um, glitter glue and I went around the edges of it to like dress it up and you know add some gold to it because that had gold on it and so that is the one again that's the back I just stamped my logo on there so that is the one that I made for her I hope she likes it I had fun making these uh, items for her um, especially the minnow because like I said I haven't made one in a while other than the other mini mail that I made for C and the haunted house uh, swap. So I'm getting back into the, the mini, mini album making. So thanks guys for watching and y'all have a crafty day. Bye.